Hello Exploders and welcome back to some more Dead Rising 3 with me, Exploding Ember, and obviously Nick. So I'm guessing we have to go through this gate as this is the place where we have to go and find some Zombrex. I think that's where we left off before we just went through the graveyard with the crazy voodoo magic. So if you want to see that episode, annotation will be somewhere on the screen. Who's this guy? Oh my god! Why are you hitting Sorry me? About that, buddy. I thought you were one of those zombies. Oh, it's fine. You got kind of a shambling thing going on. You may want to perk it up a bit. Do you need zombrex too? I need it real bad. I mean, no, no. I'm, uh, I'm just here doing a job. I'm Gary. Who the hell are you? What job Nick might that Ramos. be, Gary? Hey, do you work in there? Can you help me? In there? No, no, not that kind of job. No, my boss is kind of a big shot around here. He helps people who are uh, desperate. So he's a crook. Hey. Don't be rude. I like to say kingpin. I think it sounds a little classier. Anyways, I gotta get in there. It's and got I a point. That does sound pretty boss. classier. I uh, tell you what. Why don't Why don't you climb up there? Let yourself into the roof, then let me in. So we have to do some parkour I then. The is in there. You help me, I help you. Why won't you climb up there? All right. You don't want the Zombrex. That's not my problem. I'll catch you later, kid, maybe. No, wait. You got a deal. All right. Right. Here, let me do you a favor, Nick. Let me show you a little trick that'll come in handy sometime. Show you a little goodwill. All right, keep an eye on those zombies there, right? Watch this. Now, this is the best part. What? Oh, I, I think I remember that from the uh, last game, the second one. I actually played that one, and yeah, that that seems familiar. That actually happened, didn't it? You can do that with the bees. You can like collect them and smash them, and then they just explode. Yeah, I know, sir. I'm 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 climbing up there right now. I'm on it. I'm all over it. Yeah, I gotta cover. Right. So we still got our elis el el was electric mace with us, which is awesome. So we have to get up there somehow. Is there like a, a ladder or something? Maybe. Get these zombies out of the way because they're annoying. Get out of the way. Okay, the door. Obviously, that's locked. Otherwise, we wouldn't need to climb up. Um. Oh, a van. Okay, where, where? Oh, look, there it is. I see the van. It's quite cool this game actually because you get to use like vehicles and stuff to get to places where you couldn't get usually. Like I don't think I've found any invisible walls yet which is pretty awesome. I mean usually games are just like, ooh invisible walls, let's just give you some invisible walls. But no, this one they seem to be like, yeah you can go wherever you want. Which is cool, I like that in a game. I don't like restrictions if you get what I mean. Okay, that's pretty cool. Smashing through glass. Right. Let Gary in. Him. Why can he just pull the door open? Okay, so we got to go to where they keep the dead bodies. Lovely. Why won't it let me smash through it? Huh? What's that all about? Oh. So he can just kick and disintegrate all the bars. What? Yeah, I can't hit it with my amazing electrical mace thing. That makes sense. There is a lot of zombies in here. Well, actually, I guess it's where they store the dead bodies, so that would make sense. Uh-oh. Oh, no. This ball thing sucks. I don't even get it. What? What is it? I thought it was a bomb. That is like shrapnel or something. But clearly, it's just a ball that you throw. And I guess it kills the zombies. It like goes through them and kills them, which makes sense, I guess. Maybe a little bit. We've still got a spike bat, which is awesome. That's good. We need the spike bat. It's good. It's good. I'm also thinking about doing some horror games re um, soon. We're going to try and get some more Slenderman videos out because I know you guys loved that. It got like 900 views, which is pretty good for me. So yeah, keep an eye out for that. That'll right, be somewhere gotta soon. Find this girl. I want you to look at the names on the drawers. The name we're looking for is Nicole White. Nicole really White. 
What about my Zombrex? I could die, man. First things first. It look okay to me. What if I turn? It's okay. I got a gun. Charming. That's that's brilliant. That is. Okay, so we have to look for this Nicole Not this girl. One. This guy's is something, something the third. Yeah, mom didn't get it right the first two times. That's not her either. Nope. Okay, so where is she? Where would she be? This girl don't want to come out, does she? Why can Not I only go to like a couple of them? Hmm. Holy crap, this one's my ex mother. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Your ex mother in law. My boss, don't pay me enough for this crap. Where is she? Excuse me. Thank Looks you. like the right one, but it's locked. Oh, I found it. Okay, that's good. So now, now we have to find a key, which I'm guessing is going to be where that yellow marker is on the map. Oh look, there's a blueprint. What's this one for? The Iron Edge. Ooh. Sounds rubbish. Let's see what it's like. Sweet. So what is it, like a two-sided two blade? Okay, so where's this key? I was just looking there, and... Did I pick it up? I don't think I did. Okay, where, where's the key? Through this door? Nope, that's locked. Um, hmm. Gary, are you looking for the key as well, or is it just me? Oh my god, what, where the hell did you come from? Jesus, that scared the life out of me. <laughs> Wow, why would you do that, zombie? Why? Why? Okay. There's the key. Finally, we found the key. That's good. Right, is there anything else? Got it doesn't look like it. Okay. Dead, Sorry, my, my throat's going a bit croaky today. I don't know why. Okay, so... Nicole, this Nicole girl. Let's find her. There's nothing in there. Why would she be in the back room though? Is she gonna be like a boss? Is she a boss zombie that we're gonna have to fight now? Damn. Why couldn't he do that to the original door? Okay, there is a coffin there. I'm gonna get this IED first, because it looks awesome. Is that like the IED from Call of Duty Black Ops? Oh, uh, ghosts. I don't think so. Doesn't look like one. It looks like a shrapnel bomb. Get over here and help me with this damn coffin. Okay, okay, calm down. Jeez. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hey, you know this bro? Is that Annie? No. That's not Annie. No, I was wrong. It just looks like a girl I know. Alright, well here, come on. Help, help me help me move her. Ugh. Wait a minute. Ugh. I helped you in this place. Now it's your turn to help me. He's lost his bandage. Well, I don't know, pal. It looks like they're all out as ombrex. Where's his arm, uh, where's his bandage gone? Nick had a bandage around yes, his hand, didn't he? Where he got bit? The inevitable. I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry, really, I am. I'm sorry. Just trip up the dead body, why don't you? Hey, do you want me to off you? So you don't gotta suffer. Just hurry. All right, okay, I'm hurrying. Don't I'm do hurry. it, Nick. Coming right up. <clears throat> oh my God. I think the safety's are on. Wow. Let me see the gun. Let me see the gun. Yeah. By the way, you're welcome. You just do it. Okay, I'll do it. I'm not the best shot. Give me a moment. <laughs> did she just move or Shit. did he trip over the dead body again? Moment. Wait a minute. Look at your wound, it's healing what? itself. Doesn't it, like does it not heal then if you're a zombie? What kind of freak are you? Um, I guess I don't know what kind of freak I am. Charming. Yes, you don't need no Zombrex either. Huh. Well, it all worked out okay, you know. I mean, I didn't really want to shoot you. You seem like an okay guy. Well, thanks, Gary. That, that's, um, that helps. Thanks. Okay. Let's go. Dead ass. That dead ass. Oh my god. Really? 
Oh my god. Ooh. Just throw her in the back. I don't think your boss is going to be too happy about that, considering you just shot her in the neck. I need you to drive this stiff over to my she is dead, club, but... The diamond panty, it's right here in Angleton. I gotta get something very important. Wait, listen, I gotta get back to my friends. We might have a way out of here. We found an old plane. We just need to find a few things to get it fixed. My boss is very well connected. Do you understand what I'm saying? Very well connected. I'm sure he could get you fuel, whatever you need for the plane. Just Alright, that's good. Car, we can get some fuel. Club, all right? Come on, I gotta go. But... Okay, I'm let's think there. about this really. He seems like he's working for a gangster sort of guy, yeah, so no, he's sending us right off. Now, Why sir. isn't he getting yeah, in the I'm car with us? Way. What happens if the gangster right. leader wants to off us, like kill us when we get there? This seems a little bit fishy to me. I don't think we should do it, but I guess we kind of have to. So yeah. Anyway, that's all we have time for today, guys. We'll see what happens next time. See what happens when we get to the Diamond Panty Club sort of thing. Yeah, that place. Sounds like a nice bar. Sounds like a strip club actually. Anyway, so we'll see what happens next time. Have a good day people. Don't forget, there's buttons on this screen here. Woo! Yeah, so I've been Exploding Amber, you've been amazing. This has been Dead Rising 3. Peace out people. Goodbye.